friends let's rapid revise the cache memory in detail in the previous lecture i gave the overview about the cache memory now let us take cache memory in action okay cache memory acts as an intermediate memory between the cpu and main memory okay so let us consider with the help of this diagram that is cpu and cache memory as we saw in the previous diagram previous lecture okay cache memory is bin between the cpu and the main memory okay used to hold the image of main, main memory data okay therefore cpu accessing the main memory data from the cache memory within less amount of time hence the speed gap is synchronized between the cpu and main memory with the introduction of cache memory that is cpu is the fastest unit and the main memory is slow component so in order to synchronize the uh, we can say the data speed uh, speed gap so a speed gap cache memory is used and the speed gap is synchronized with the help of cache memory it is a very important concept in the field of computer organization okay so um, we know that cache memory main memory data is in the form of blocks and <coughs> from c uh, cache memory to cpu data is transferred in the form of words cache memory uses the locality of reference property okay so here in the cache memory we are going to consider the following elements the following design elements will, will be design elements are first of all memory organization first one is memory organization second is mapping techniques okay different mapping techniques will be there like set associative direct mapping and associative mapping third one is replacement policy that is how we are going to replace the block if there is a conflict okay then uh, writing policy and after that is multi level cache design okay so that is all that we are going to study in the design elements so first one is memory organization second is mapping technique replacement policies writing policies and multi level cache design once we have got all these points then we are done with the cache memory concept thank you and uh, keep watching the next uh, design elements of cache memory thank you